Hi, in this short tutorial I'll be showing you how to access full articles, the full text of articles from Pioneer's um, database called EBSCO. And to do that I'm just going to go ahead and open up a web browser. You could choose Internet Explorer, Firefox, Google Chrome, whatever you want to use. I'm going to open up Firefox and I'll just go up to the web address here, uh, the URL uh, bar, and I'll type in pioneer.uen.org. Now, um, because I'm out of school, it gives me direct access in, uh, but if you try to access this from home, you would be asked for a login and password, and if, you have, if you're a current teacher and have a MyUEN account, then you can just go ahead and type in your MyUEN login and password, and you'll get into the system. If not, you'll need to put in this year's Pioneer uh, login and password in order to access it. We change that every year in August, uh, August 1st, so um, you would need to to put in that password. Once you do, you'll see the Pioneer Library here at the left. I'm going to go ahead and click EBSCO, and it gets me into the, to a list of different databases, different uh, different um, areas in the, the EBSCO catalog and also different ways that you can access that with different levels of, of EBSCO. I'm just going to choose all databases at the top there. Let's say I'm looking for uh, an article or newspaper um, story about questioning strategies. I could pick and choose the particular database that would probably have that information and you know in the, I could go ahead and do that in the interest of time I'm just gonna click select and desele or deselect all and because I've clicked it once it selects all I click continue I'm just gonna search all of those databases that way I don't have to uh, take the time right now to to read a description of each one and, and pick the perfect ones um, doing it this way will give me more results generally also okay it's loaded up I'm going to go ahead and type in what I'm looking for, which is questioning strategies. And in this case, I'm only interested in getting the full text of each document. So I'm going to go ahead and put a check mark here where it says full text. Now, if I miss this step, if I don't do that, I, I will get more results, but many of the results will be just little stubs of our articles. It, I won't be able to read the actual article. So that's the trick. And then you just click search and all of the results that you get will be articles, journal articles, newspaper articles, magazine stories and things like that that, uh, that we have the full article um, accessible to, to us. Notice I got five pages worth of results, and each one has a link that says full text. I'm going to go to this, uh, this seventh one here, and notice this one has HTML full text, and it also has PDF full text. I'm going to choose PDF full text. I click on it, and it opens up with the full article. All right, hopefully that's been uh, useful to you and it's helped you to know how to access complete articles through EBSCO. Um, remember the big trick was before you actually do your search, click the checkbox that says full text. All right, good luck using EBSCO.